becoming who you are as a man. Welcome back, my friend. I hope you're having a great day. As usual, let's get straight into it. Now, in a previous video where I talked about why you're losing your edge as a man, I basically stated that overthinking is the reason why you're losing your edge. You have all of these desires and to get to them, you're thinking of this way, that way, continuously just trying to find the perfect way to get these desires, totally forgetting that sometimes you got to just pick one route and just go with it. Grab your nuts and go. And for some of you, yes, this is what you need. You just literally need to pick the most simple plan to go from A to B. Then just go, go, go and learn along the way. Now, there are some of you out there who got to use a bit of logic. You got to step back and you got to use your brain. You got to study. You got to analyze. Understand, as a man, woman, child, I don't care what you are. You and you alone got to always remember this, that you are an individual person with a brain. I don't judge anyone because, you know, throughout my life, I've began to understand that everyone will have their own journey in life. I have my opinions. I have some hacks. I have some philosophies that has helped me. If you're an individual like me who believes in more, who has a lot of energy and is sometimes is somewhat delusional to the world of reality and just believes that if you work your ass off, you can achieve crazy shit. Yes, you can side with some of my philosophies and understand that when you do that, 51% of your time, your day and your energy is going to be put towards just grabbing your balls and winging it. Because you are at the cutting edge of what you do, you are the leader of your niche, your sub niche, or you're trying to be the best of the best at what you do, you're not going to be able to really study and plan and get advice because like I said, you're at the cutting edge. You're going to be first. No one is going to be doing what you're doing. You're going to be leading the field. And as the leader, you got to have that foresight and you got to have that ability to just walk into the unknown. Because as the leader, you are heading your niche, your job, your career, whatever it is you're doing into the new land. So again, 51% of your time is going to be put towards just grabbing your nuts and going. The other 49% of your time, yes, that can be going towards study and just really reading taking in knowledge, studying other people's lives, and just really using your analytical mind to give you the confidence to just step out on faith. Now, sometimes for some of you individuals, it'll be the other way. 51% of the time, you're going to be using pure logic. Like I said, you're going to be using math, science, coming up with formulas, writing things down on paper, typing it out, very by the book. And that's okay. Then the other 49% of the time, you're going to be kind of just leaning into your edge, kind of really just stepping out on faith. There is no right and wrong answers within this life. What you got to understand and know is that evolution will always be the theme within your life. And as an individual, if you are here now, wherever you are, and two years from now, you're in the same place with no progress, with no gains, with no wisdom learned. Dude, you are just wasting your life. Evolution is guaranteed with everyone. You're going to get older. You're going to get wiser. Some people do it faster than others. How you get there is totally up to you. So there's nothing wrong with taking a step back and really, you know, just analyzing where you went, where you are, where you're trying to go making some graphs, bullet points, having meetings, talking, 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 putting things on paper. Sometimes that's what you got to do. For me, like I said, because I want to be the best and give my best and just be the leader at whatever the fuck I'm doing, that just calls me to just really lean into faith and just saying yes to everything, seeing what sticks and whatever doesn't stick, fuck it, just trash it and we'll move on. So for you, 
just becoming who you are as a man. You got to learn to listen to your intuition, listen to your experiences, listen to what you're feeling and paying attention to where you want to go, the actions you need to take and what actions are really going to get you there instead of wasting your time. That could be studying or that could just be going balls to the wall. Whatever you choose, use that choice with full responsibility and Don't let excuses hold you back. That's how you become who you are as an individual, as a man, as a person who leads their life and who takes responsibility for everything in it and just uses their time to progress themselves, to help and progress others. That's just what it is. And just always remember, train hard and be kind.